Yo, what's good? It's Brother Brandon here with the Lick of the Day, the guitar lesson of the day, the free guitar lesson. Check it out. We got the Red Strat. We're uh, playing through the Corey Wong Neural DSP on the clean setting because we love it. Super easy, great tone. I thought I'd show you a little exercise today, a little warm up because I haven't played guitar yet. So this is one of the many ways that I warm up. It's a little stretch. Give it one of these guys. Just make sure you're all together. We're going to learn this exercise called the spider. I've been teaching this to a lot of my students lately because they've been asking, Mr. Brandon, how do I get my dexterity better? And I say, what a coincidence you ask, my friend, because I have the greatest exercise known to man called the spider just for that exact question. All right, so the concept is every finger gets a fret. Say that after me. Every finger gets a fret. Exactly, good job. Okay, so we're gonna take the first finger on the lowest string, the E string, Eddie, eight, dynamite, goodbye, Eddie. Those are the names of the strings. We're gonna take the first finger on the first fret. We're gonna pick down. We're gonna take the second finger on the second fret. We're gonna pick up. We're gonna do the third finger on the third fret. We're gonna pick down. We're gonna do the fourth finger on the fourth fret, and we're gonna pick up. So it's down, up, down, up. One, two, three, four, right? We're gonna do that on every single string. And you want it to sound pretty. You wanna think about it just being beautiful. You wanna think about your picking. You wanna think about you know, the vibrato of each note, the sustain, playing exactly on the tips of your fingers. We're not really making music right now. We're, we could, but we're trying to warm up. We're trying to feel comfortable. I think when people say, oh man, that guy has a great feel on the guitar or on the drum set or whatever, they have a great feel, right? I think what they mean is that they feel very comfortable on their instrument. And why? Probably because that dude's warmed up or played for a million hours of his life. You know, and this is one of the few ways I do this. I don't do this all the time, but it's a good way to start. Just one, two, three, four. Now there's a couple different ways we could do this, right? Just straight up. We go backwards, right? Backwards is always harder for some reason. I don't know why. So we could change it up, right? We could do one, three, two, four, one, three, two, four. So I can work on that one. One, three, two, four, one, three, two, four, one, three, two, four. One, three, two, four. Can we go backwards? I don't do that very often. I just made that up but I could do something like that because that's something that I practice. So you can come up with any combo of these kind of, you know, spider exercises. I don't know what word you want to use there, but you get the point. You could use any variation of the fingers. The other thing that you could work on beyond just playing them in random orders, and you could also just skip strings. Right? You could do like E string. D string, A string, G string, and that's a cool idea. That's fun. Never done that before either, but et cetera, et cetera. You could do it with just hammer on, so you only pick the first note and you hammer on all the other notes. Check that out. So that's all left hand, right hand only picks down. That's how you play fast. I mean, if I, I don't even think I can pick each note like that. So yeah, like pick once and then hammer on. Can you pull off? Woo, that's good for you. That's good for you. Yeah. Can you pull off quickly, right? So the other thing that you could do beyond that is just move it up in different positions. We could do it on the second fret, two, three, four, five. Just same idea. Can you do it on the seventh fret? Seven, eight, nine, ten. Right? Woo, that sounds nice. Can you do a pick -in? or pull offs? <laughs> hammer ons, pick offs. <laughs> pull offs, hammer ons. There you go. Hammer it on. Maybe now it's uh, 2, 4, 3, 1. <laughs> that could be a lick if you wanted it to be. <laughs> Yeah, I don't know, just pick a random order, but that's a good way to warm up. I already feel like I'm getting it together. 
bonus round, bonus points, bonus points. Are you ready? Okay, here's the, the bonus lick. So if that's position one, and this is every finger gets a fret, what if every finger skips a fret? And we do three notes. So we do one, three, five, 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 one, three, five. That's like the scale, bro. You know what I mean? You guys are messing up. There we go. <laughs> but yeah, you got a double note in there. A couple of them, but that's alright. But yeah, I like this position a lot for playing. This kind of three notes per string. If you did four notes per string, right? That's pretty cool too. That's a pretty underrated uh, Alan Holdorf way of playing. So that's ultra super bonus points for the end if you could do four notes per string. But that's kind of how the scales adapt. I mean, if you're on position two, that's just like G major, right? Like all these things kind of just come from these exercises. So don't underestimate the spider exercise because it leads to scales. It leads to this madness. You know what I mean? It leads to all these things. It leads to all the cool whittly dees and the tweedly doos. So uh, be sure to like and subscribe. That was the spider exercise. I don't remember when I learned that, but it was forever ago. And everyone always asks me, how do I get better at dexterity? Just do the spider exercise, dude. And if you're really good, you could do one, three, five as well all over the neck. Um, another thing that I challenge kids, especially little ones or people who are very beginners to, at guitar, can you just move one of your fingers without moving the other finger? That has really nothing to do with the guitar, but a lot of these kids, just like they can't just be moving their pinky on its own, and it shows. So um, practice that too. All right, like and subscribe. Big love, Brother Brandon out. Free guitar lessons for life, y'all. Peace.